My name is Jay Patrick and I'm auditioning for UAL Level 3 Diploma in Acting. This is a piece from Fluffy Rabbit by Paul Charlton. I've been to bed for ages. It was a good night tonight. They laughed loud. No bad talking till the smash. I jumped. It was my fault. I held my breath for ages and I only breathed under the duvet. I'd only a little bit as well. I stayed really still and hoped that they'd stop. I thought that maybe my mind might be able to make them stop, like Dad said. And it worked. They stopped talking bad to each other and I felt good because I could help stop it. Then I breathed properly. Just after that, they started again. So I stopped again, but it wouldn't work anymore. Mum was screaming louder than ever. I'd never heard it that bad. I couldn't hear the words they were saying. So I went into the spare room to hear better. If you leave, I'll kill you. He said a bad word. He never says bad words. Maybe the devil had got him. Or the Sandman, or a monster, or all of them together. It must be. They must be making him say it. If they could make him say bad words, then they might make him hurt Mum. God wasn't helping, and I didn't think my lightsaber would work against all of them. And holding my breath had stopped working, so I was stuck. I had to use my special brain power in another way. I had to. I picked up one of my dad's dumbbells that he uses and I held it out in front of me. I fought with all my brain for him to stop. If I could just hold it out and not drop it, he might stop. The monsters might leave him alone. My arms were killing me. They were really heavy. But if I could just stop being so horrible, and think about my mum and dad. Not me, think about saving my mum and not being scared. And it was working, it had gone quiet, but I knew if I let them down, it would be like the breathing thing. He would start again, except this time, I wouldn't have much of a mum afterwards. I started to shake. I was trying to hold on. Honest, but it just dropped smash to the floor noise on the stairs the monster's coming for me my dad's going to get me but it was me mum i saved her <laughs>